guys welcome back okay so today I wanted to do just a good old-fashioned swatch party I really have been buying a lot of different single shadows from different brands indie brands of course and one of the brands that I purchased some shadows from is Luxy, Luxy Beauty and I've never tried their shadows before, never even swatched or anything with the shadows that I've purchased. But I did notice on their website that they had some absolutely gorgeous shimmers, dual chromes, multi chromes. Now they did recently come out with a new collection which was the Butterfly Kisses and it's sold out. I believe it might have sold out twice. I don't know, but I think it is coming back. Just looking at the website, there is like an email notification thing. So I believe it is coming back, just in case you like these shadows. Um, but what I am really curious about as far as the quality and how these shimmers, dual chromes, multi-chromes look is because the price was crazy compared to other brands. Their shadows were, I believe, $3 a piece because I got the whole bundle. This, These two rows down here is the Butterfly Kisses bundle, and I got it for $10, $30. So I got all 10 shades for $30, which three bucks a shade, that's a really good price. So yeah, I'm really curious as far as how they're gonna <laughs> look and swatch. These top two rows were shadows that I had already purchased previously before they came out with the Butterfly Kisses bundle and hadn't used them or tried them out yet. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna swatch all of these shadows today and just kind of give you the names and show you what they look like. I'm not good at describing the different shifts and tones and all that stuff. I'll swatch it and let you look at it and you judge for yourself <laughs> what it looks like. But yeah, they are really, really pretty here in the pans. Let me give you a close up look just so you can kind of see what they look like in the pans and we'll go ahead and start swatching okay you guys so i took all my shadows out of my magnetic palette because i didn't want to have to take the time trying to pop them all out and you know with nails you end up digging all in the shadows but i just took them all out to make it easy for me so i can just pick them up tell you the name and swatchity swatch okay now i have all shimmers metallics dual chromes and stuff in my collection I don't know why I didn't buy any mattes. I guess at the time I wasn't really feeling matty, <laughs> but I definitely am going to go back and purchase some mattes from their website because I see that they do have some shades that I'm interested in. So let's go ahead and get to swatching. Keep my specs handy because y'all know I'll be telling y'all the wrong name and everything. <laughs> Okay, so this first one I have, and I'm going to do the Butterfly Kisses collection last. So what I'll do is I'll probably put like a timestamp. If you don't care about these other shades and you only care about the Butterfly Kisses, then I'll put a timestamp so that you'll know where to skip to if you just want to see those. Okay, so this first one is called Electric Venom. Very, very pretty bright green shade. Oh, that's very pretty very pretty and you can see how it went over my tattoo gorgeous next we have spyro spyro Ooh, that's pretty as well gorgeous this one is November rain That one is pretty as well. Very, very close to the previous shade, but I can see just a slight difference there. <laughs> this one is That's What She Said. Very pretty gold shade. This one is One Night Stand. One Night Stand. gorgeous red shade I don't know if you can tell I'm not really into red shimmers all that much <laughs> they're pretty just not on me this one is high roller high roller 
Oh, that's pretty. Nice, beautiful, dark purple shade. I wanna go over that one just a little bit more. Yeah, very, very pretty. I'm not really seeing any shifts in these shadows. Um, if it is, it's a very faint one, maybe on these upper ones. Next, I have Dream Boat. Dream Boat. This one looks like a really, really pretty inner corner. Yeah, gorgeous inner corner. Perfect to get that pop on. This one is Doll Face. Doll Face. That's pretty. I can definitely see a bit of a shift in there. Looks like a gold and pink shift. I'll let you see from a distance. Ooh, that's pretty. This one is Mula. Mula. AKA Money. <laughs> Oh, that's pretty. Really pretty. Excuse my hairy arms. <laughs> this one is neon. Neon. You can kind of see that. It looks like purple to orange a little bit in the pan. Ooh, that's pretty. Yeah, that's really pretty. These shadows, other than doll face, they don't really have like a strong shift, but I definitely can see that in there. It's really, really pretty. And lastly, I have Sun Kiss. Sun Kiss. Ooh. Oh, Sun Kiss is pretty. Yeah, that's gorgeous. I would say, yeah, these are definitely not like the most blinding shimmers or, you know, multi-chromes, dual chromes, whatever that you can find for sure. But if you're just trying to get your feet wet and you don't want to spend, you know, 10, 12 bucks or even seven or eight bucks, <laughs> you know, for a single shimmer or dual chrome, then these are really, really pretty very pretty okay so these are all the ones that I purchased that are not a part of the butterfly kisses so now I'm gonna wipe off my arm and we will go ahead and swatch the butterfly kisses okay so this first one that I'm gonna swatch from the butterfly kisses is called nectar so this is what nectar looks like so this is what it looks like on my finger And that's what she looks like swatched. Nectar. This is the Monarch. This is what the Monarch looks like on my finger. And that's what the Monarch looks like swatched. This is Angel Wings. Angel Wings. This is what Angel Wings looks like on my finger. Ooh, Angel Wings is gorgeous. Look at that. Oh yeah, she looks like Angel Wings. <laughs> That's pretty. Next I have Sky Flower. Sky Flower. And this is what Sky Flower looks like on my finger. And that Sky Flower swatched. Very, very bright. Definitely we use that for an inner corner for sure. Very pretty. This is Flutter. Flutter. This is what Flutter looks like on my finger. Ooh, 
very, very creamy. So that's Flutter. This is Caddy Pillar. Caddy Pillar. This is what Caddy Pillar looks like. Really pretty. One of my favorites so far. That's gorgeous. Caddy Pillar is pretty. Very pretty. This is Crimson Rose. Crimson Rose. And this is what Crimson Rose looks like on my finger. I would have to say this whole collection is very, very light. Very light. So if you don't really like, you know, lighter <laughs> duo or, or multi-chrome shadows, then this might not be your cup of tea. This one is Emerald. Emerald. Ooh, I see why it's called Emerald. Did you guys see that? I saw that green shift when I was swatching it. I saw it. You can see it now. It's like green and what is that? Purple. Yep, I see it. Because <laughs> looking at it, you'd be like, why is it called emerald? But yeah, there is a green shift in there. This one is Painted Lady. Painted Lady. And this is what Painted Lady looks like on my finger. Oh, so pretty. Painted Lady is very, very pretty as well. Gorgeous. I can really see a pretty shift in there. And last, I have Apollo. So this is Apollo. And this is what Apollo looks like on my finger. Okay, Apollo. That's pretty. Yeah, that's really pretty. But hopefully it's not too bright to where you can't truly see like the colors and the slight shifts. I would have to say that these I can see why they're three dollars <laughs> as opposed to like the seven or eight bucks that you might pay for you know some of the other brands i would say it's very light very dainty not as aggressive as some of the more expensive multi dual chrome shimmers that you can purchase from other indie brands um it's a very light soft dainty collection in my opinion definitely goes with the name butterfly kisses but it's very very pretty i would definitely have to say my favorite are you know these last two this one here the emerald that's gorgeous this gold um this one is gorgeous for inner corner pop i mean they're all really pretty though it's like you know as i look at them now they're all really pretty it's just you know, the shift and everything is not as aggressive as some of the other indie brands that I pay way more than $3 for <laughs> two or three times the amount. But like I said, if you want to get your feet wet and just try them out, try out Luxie Beauty. They are really nice and the quality is really nice. They feel really good. So $3 is a really good price for these shadows. So that's it, you guys. Thank you so much for hanging out with me to swatch my Luxie Beauty shadows. Hopefully you had a good time. Let me know in the comments what you think, what your thoughts are. Do you have some Luxie shadows? Are you trying to get a hold of the butterfly kisses? And, you know, just let your girl know. So that's it, you guys. Thanks so much for hanging out with me during this swatch party to check out these swatches. And I will see you on my next video. Toodles!